you have a long history with the members of NWA, but when was the first time you heard an NWA song? I heard uh, Strata Compton when I was on 126th Street in Normandy in Los Angeles. And I remember thinking, they're writing about our lives over here. <laughs> it was crazy, it, and it was honest, and it was true, and it was gritty, and it was politi politically incorrect, and I loved it. <laughs> uh, I, was, I, was, I was young, man. I used to, I mean, I was born in 88, so you know what I mean? <laughs> right, Part of it was right, like, you know. Right. But um, it's crazy, because the vinyls actually used to play in the house. And um, and Gangsta Gangsta is one of my favorite songs. <laughs> right. I just remember you, you know, just being a little kid and just like rocking out to it, even though I probably shouldn't have been. <laughs> you know what I mean? Right. And in New Orleans, they have like a huge, like bounce remix to Boys in the Hood. Mm -hmm. You know that they use to like cover all the hoods in New Orleans. So Boys in the Hood has always been something that's been like directly related to everything that I've done since a child. You mm -hmm. know, and it's it's still my favorite, you know, song to this day. So. Yeah. You had the inside track, obviously. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I'm a 90s baby, unlike, you know, these two. But, uh, I would say uh, I've, I've heard it all throughout the house, but I really started listening and really started to, you know, wonder about my father's, you know, past when I was about 15. Mm -hmm. And then Gangsta Gangsta is my favorite song. Yeah, okay. That song's hot. Easy verse. <laughs> Easy killing. So I'm asking everyone today, when, the, when was the first time they heard N.W.A.? So I'm going to ask you, when was the first time you heard one of your songs on the air? Uh, driving, actually driving to the swap meet with Dre. And we was, li we was listening to K-Day at the time, Greg Mack. And they play Boys in the Hood. You know, that was the first time I heard like, like my lyrics, right? Yeah. You know, on the and song. it was on everything. Number yeah. one. <laughs> Did it make it real for you? Um, yeah, very real. You know, but just having a record was real. You know, seeing that record pressed and having it in my hand, and that was real enough. You know, that was that was about as uh, real as I thought it was gonna get. I'm coming straight out of town. Come on.